Yeah, congratulations, soul model. So your soul is, I pray uh, to the Almighty Allah so that your soul, may your soul be immortal. Thank you. Junshio, my goodness. How many have you written down? Press, press, press. <coughs> Where's the first comment I got is good afternoon from Madhuju. Good afternoon, Baba. So, <coughs> Asmira, good afternoon. And Soul Model, good afternoon. And Junshio, I don't know, time is showing the same. So actually, kiss a baller name. Okay, first I don't have second grade. So thank you. To hear all of us, come Baba. Okay, okay, no problem. So good afternoon, my dear students, and you are most welcome to this English class. And Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. So let's start our class and today is a very special day as you know. This is uh, today is initial Mother's Day. Mother's <coughs> Happy Mother's Day, right? That's good. So here you see one uh, quotation is there about mother. Perhaps you can read it. And this is the real uh, thing that happens usually in our life. And every mother loves her child, of course. And every child loves her mother as well and thinks to be the best mother in the world so and that's why this is the characteristic of a mother as you see there you see a mom will sit in the rain to watch her child sit on the bench this is the so truth especially if you go to uh, your school anywhere you go to school you don't know because you remain in the classroom but your your mother i sometimes see and uh, look at some mothers uh, sitting outside of the classroom or uh, sitting some places and they're they are so anxious and they always are really worried about, worried to know about their son or daughter what they are doing in the classroom that's great and this is the thing actually you have to feel whenever you will grow old and you have to feel this anxiety and the same anxiety that they are feeling from you now of course so that type of uh, actually an example is written here and they always do the things for your betterment right so uh, let's uh, and uh, actually uh, I want to say again that uh, if someone asks me sir I'm the barber actor of the whole Egypt. If you tell me, egg John Manuska Halovasta, the Halo of Shemaki Halovasta, Maki Shopje Postle, I think that's it. I've got a corporation. If you don't do for any other people in the world, so Tahlo Chulbe, but don't neglect your mother. Okay, let's start our class. And here you see uh, the conversation. Uh, here is a conversation as you see there are two persons on the screen and one is saying, I'm traveling to Dhaka tomorrow. Another one is saying, another one is listening. He is not saying anything, right? And he will say later on. And uh, that person who, say, who was going to travel, I'm sorry, Ikto just to make it to it for act me to move me to pull away it. Okay, you see uh, here you see uh, the person uh, he is saying I shall travel to Dhaka tomorrow and there the next day the next day the man who was listening to him the next day he was telling his mother what he was telling 
I saw Korim yesterday. Bullo je ma dhano. I'm Korim ke gato kal dekh chila. And he told me that. I'm Shama ke bollo. I have traveled to Dhaka tomorrow. <clears throat> so, do you think is the sentence is incorrect? Do you think this sentence is incorrect? Or what is the what is the wrong? <clears throat> Uh, what is the wrong there? Thank you. So what is the wrong there in this sentence? Uh, you say because uh, uh, this boy or this man uh, listens to him very clearly that he was talking it, he was telling about this sentence. And he just go home and, and told his mother that the same thing, the same thing that he Heard. And if someone says or reports someone species this way, exactly the same without using comma inverted comma, that is not a correct sentence, of course. That is not a, a correct sentence. That is a wrong sentence. And uh, that's why we see, Amra Jokhani Karo Kotha Onno Keo Jokhan, Obikal Bolbe, Mane Report Korbe, so at that moment, Taka Oshe Comma Inverted Comma use Kotha. If someone doesn't use Comma Inverted Comma in that case, we have to see that we have to learn that that is not a direct space in direct space comma and where comma is the sign or that, that it is a must okay it is a must right so the right answer is here can you please write down the uh, right answer i want to see any one of you write down the correct answer what will be the correct answer then and what was the wrong okay let's see uh, the right answer is here I saw Korim yesterday and he told me that he would travel to Dhaka the next day. So there were three mistakes. The first one is there was the mistake in the person. There was the mistake in the person and would travel. There was the chance, there would be the chance of uh, change of tense. Another one is about the, about the word tomorrow because tomorrow will change into the next day. It is a আমরা যখন এক দেখো এই মানুষটার সাথে কাজ থেকে যখন সে কথাটা শুনলো আবার আরেক জায়গায় যাচ্ছে তার দুইটা জিনিস পাল্টে যাচ্ছে কিন্তু একটা টাইম আর একটা হচ্ছে প্লেস পারফেক্ট ইউ ক্যান আন্ডারস্ট্যান্ড সো ডাইরেক্ট থেকে আমরা যখন ইন্ডিকেট করতে যাই তখন আমাদের দুইটা জিনিস পাল্টে যায় একটা টাইম এন্ড প্লেস সো এই টাইম এন্ড প্লেস रिलेटेड যে জিনিসগুলো থাকবে সেগুলো সবই কিন্তু চেঞ্জ করতে হবে that's why I can have tomorrow at time related uh, word. So it uh, comes tomorrow the next day, yesterday the previous day. Perhaps you know all of these rules. So you can guess already you have guessed that your topic will be what? Right. So your topic today is um, today's what? Need on a rat. Okay. And of course you have to rearrange it. Uh, uh, this is uh, this uh, latest should be changed should be earnest to make it a, a word you are so clever right narration is your topic today need on a rat or chips that means space that's good Junshio is so fast and uh, gaming one run gaming so you are also first Okay, and that is your topic, right? So probably you love this topic very much. Who loves this topic very much? A topic to shop chevish personal or okay, kama get to yes, like a Just write down yes. Or those who hate this topic, you just write down I hate it. Do you know it? This is the easiest grammatical topic in English grammar. And shop che shaho jhutche je e narration ta. Yes, <laughs> you love it. Great, congratulations. So a topic ta ashle onek mojar. A topic ke just simply uh, exceptions kulo onek kaum. As usually we get a lot of exceptions in other uh, grammatical topics. But uh, in comparison with that, uh, but this is very important topic for you 
of course because you have to practice it you have to learn it uh, whenever you will be 9 10 11 12 okay and so on all through your life in it this is a crying end okay, now uh, tell me what is the necessity of narration why do we learn narration whenever any conversation is taking place and after a few moments it is uh, we uh, uh, the event or the incident is changing its time and place time and place to change so any kind of incident if you want to if you want to write transform uh, if you want to transformation is easy sure thank you right uh, so jekon incident ke ami describe korte chai after the incident have occurred or have had occurred tokhon kintu amader we need to know this narration obviously there is no other alternative so this is so important to talk so let's start so this time at very beginning i want to take a test for you and i want to see uh, because you have learned it in class 7 and also in class 8 so this time i want to take a test for you the first question for you is here please be ready with the answer write down your answer so fast as you can the first question is before you here you see the boy said to me i am going to school tomorrow so you please write down your answers test at the beginning because uh, this test is based on your prior knowledge you have already learned this topic in class 7 and also in class 8 that's why i want to start this class with a test so you please start writing the answer So we can, uh, I want to see who will write the first answer. Wow, actually the boy told me that uh, he was going to school that day. The boy told me that he was going to school the previous day. Why Farhan previous day? Previous day can ask you. Tomorrow the previous day, why? Safiya Likacho Dabai told me that he was going to school the next day. Sorry, I'm going tomorrow. I'm going tomorrow. <coughs> right, I'm going tomorrow because it is future indicating present. The boy told me that he was going to school the next day. The boy told me that he was going to school the next day. Most of you have written this answer. Great, congratulations. Congratulations, congratulations, and congratulations. But your answer is absolutely wrong. I'm really sorry. You have tried a lot. Uh, you are mixing up two things. One, you are saying he was going to school and you are saying the next day so these two things are uh, not matching right with each other so the boy told me that he is going blah blah no 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 i'm sorry uh, no one has right on the correct answer everyone uh, has has written the wrong answer so the right answer is here you see the boy told me that he would be going to school the next day uh, he would be going to school the next day perhaps you were very angry with me and said ask ki she helena okay yato din dhura ama deke je amra to bhul korchi right so don't worry right so your answer is there it would be would be going why if there is just look at this sentence and here you see there are two uh, types of uh, there is a one type of tense that is called present uh, future indicating present tense future indicating present tense tense future indicating present the sentence the structure of this sentence uh, is uh, in the present or tense is in the present but 
that refers to or uh, that indicates to the future tense. If you look at future indicating present bola hai. So in that case, future indicating present joy thake, to akhon tomake avoshoy uder bebohar korte hobe. Chikatse uder bebohar korte hobe. That means I am going to school tomorrow means I shall be going to school tomorrow. I shall be going to school tomorrow. So in that case, shall be money. She can a person to change way here for a would be going. So perhaps you can understand now. Didn't get it. Joshua took help or going to it at all have present in the future indicating present. Johan a going to that way or future tense that way future indicating the word school or the shagula that way. Tokon second to make a future a polyvotan quarter. Because I am going to school tomorrow means I shall be going to school tomorrow. That means he would be going to school the next day. The answer will be there. And the next answer, next question is here before you. And if I say I go to school tomorrow, the boy said to me, I go to school tomorrow. I go to school tomorrow. I go to school tomorrow. It is in the future indicating present, but present indefinite tense, and you will have to think it in the future indefinite tense. I shall go to school tomorrow. It is a good thing. He would go to school the next day. Probably you can understand it. Don't you have got the point? Thank you. So you see, the next question is before you. I said to him, Excuse me, sir. So uh, would you please write down the answer? Now, would you please write down the answer now? And here you see, excuse me, sir. Tuma sir, what's your Excuse me, sir. Thakle, tumra poli bhot mata jano. I respectfully request him to excuse me. Hamim likha chhu. I respectfully requested him to excuse me. All right. Okay. So, any more answer? Uh, don't be afraid please write down your answer <clears throat> okay there are around 30 students addressing as sir i say to him to excuse me uh, uh, excuse me uh ke jeta bolchi james sir among dear e dutu shobder khetre ekhono excuse ekhono ei addressing boshena thik ache Sorry, Ketra Bosha respectfully about dear Ketra affectionately. So, Sir Ketra Eshogulo Bojbena. So, I think you will be careful further. It's a more like a chest of Okay. Okay. Shabai Liko, I mean, take the chai, respectfully requested him to excuse me. I want to see everyone writing the answer. I respectfully requested him to excuse me. Uh, okay, I respectfully request him to excuse me. Faran did request. Why? Request, uh, keep up a high. Junshio Likona Gano. I begged excuse from him with respect. <laughs> My goodness. Uh, you are so clever indeed. So why why don't you uh, go uh, uh, go an easy way? Arik to chest up or a liko, Junshio, the Mautu almost Kathakasi Jatse. In the Tumi shop, why aren't you using excuse as a verb? I'm sorry, this time your answer is not correct, and anyone of you has not written the correct answer. Okay, uh, Junshio was somehow a bit close to the right answer, uh, but Shudumatro excuse take on Aunisha Vavar Kurache. In some cases, I can uh, I can say the right answer in one sense, but the right answer actually, actually 
uh, will be there respectfully to me and you know, to pay, you know? Achha. Achha. so you see i begged him to excuse me and Jujio, your answer is correct so okay i'm taking your answer thank you but you can write down so easily but yeah right so <coughs> Okay, so so easy. The yeah, excuse me, do you think about excuse that class will be big boss of the hobby? Excuse that you was a big boss of the hobby. I can respectfully but respected by requested regular hobby. So simply, I begged him to excuse me. I respectfully, oh, I'm sorry, I can respectfully got a bit of hobby. I respectfully begged him to excuse. Okay, I'm sorry, uh, respectfully, got it, I missed that. And uh, you have to bring this word. I respectfully begged him to excuse me. Otherwise, I, I begged him to excuse me with respect. Okay? With respectfully, no need to write down. Begged him with respectfully. You cannot write down approval. Uh, and you have to write down with respect. You can write down with respect. I begged him with respect to excuse me. Okay, you can write down that. But respectfully, respectfully is an adverb. So before adverb, we cannot use any preposition. Preposition can sit either before noun or pronoun. Okay. So you have to write down respect. Okay. The next question is before you. Probably you are angry with me. So this time probably you will make the correct answer. I hope so. So I'm waiting for your right answer. So he said to me, I wish I were a king said to me i wish i were a king so here you see so what type of sentence it is if i say i wish i were a king so what do you think what type of sentence it is Uh, you please keep on writing. There are so many students. I want to see everyone writing. So far, you just keep on writing answers. I want to see everyone to write down the answer. What type of sentence it is? He said to me, Tumra ki boi khata kotho shab bheer kore niya chho na ki jya, to shamaay lag chho to likta. Kya par, actu no to likcha na gharna na ki. You see, just, I'm just making it easy. He said to me, I wish I were a king. So this is, you may think this is an optative sentence. Optative sentence, no, I'm sorry, uh, this is not an optative sentence. Uh, this is an assertive sentence, right? This is an assertive sentence. Uh, this is an assertive sentence. So this is not an optative sentence. And the optative sentence is, if I were a king, okay? Yeah. And whenever in place of if or would that you are using I wish it just to just to make it assertive sentence. Then na monopoly akhon. assertive. That's good. He told me that he wished he had been a king. That's great. Congratulations, Junshio. This time you are writing the answer. <coughs> Thank you. Is there any other Bhuvan? Is there any other student? You can't write the answer. 
अच्छा इफ यू मेक मिस्टेक सो आई हैव टोल्ड यू 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 आर नॉट मेकिंग मिस्टेक मींस यू आर नॉट ट्राइंग टू लर्न एनीथिंग ओके देयर आर 29 स्टूडेंट्स आई सी हियर but only one answer okay let's see uh, junshu uh, right your answer was almost right but i think your answer is not correct at this moment uh, <coughs> hey hello hi, how are you mahira layan i'm fine by the grace of almighty allah alhamdulillah so uh, junshu your answer uh, a bit incorrect there you see the right answer is here he told me that he wished he were a king so and your mistake was there you had uh, you have used had been but uh, had been is not the right answer hamim likhachu i'm sorry baba i'm sorry nivit jante tu keno bhul korle yes the answer he told me that he wished he were a king he wished he were a king so i am this is you know i were a king this is called an unreal past this is called an unreal past and if your sentence is an unreal past if your tense is in the unreal past there will be no change of the tense tahole shei khetre ashole tense e kono poriborton hoy na usually we may get unreal past after a wish fancy it is high time it is time so it gulo pore shanto amra acha don't worry baba all right i know you know this rule after that okay so he was he were a king so this time your answer you will you must write the answer i mean your answer was a bit incorrect because you have used here had been tahole unreal past e kintu kono poriborton hobe na ashole eta kothin er kichu nei onek shohoj jinish hoyto tumra bhule gecho na that's the thing সো আমরা খুব সহজ জিনিস দেখো যে উইস থাকলে তারপরে যে টেন্স থাকবে সেটাকে আনরিয়েল পাস্ট বলা হয় সে আনরিয়েল পাস্টের কোনো পরিবর্তন হয় না তাহলে আনরিয়েল পাস্ট কোথায় পাওয়া যায় আনরিয়েল পাস্ট পাওয়া যায় হচ্ছে যে উইস ফেন্সি ইট ইস হাই টাইম ইট ইস টাইম এগুলো পরে সাধারণত আনরিয়েল পাস্ট থাকে যেমন ইফ আই গিভ ওয়ান এক্সাম্পল ইট ইস হাই হি সেক টু মি ইট ইস হাই টাইম উই স্টার্টেড আওয়ার জার্ন তাহলে হি টোল মে দ্যাট ইট ওয়াজ হাই টাইম দে স্টার্টেড দেয়ার জার্নি ওকে He said, "Oh God, please save me." So you see, "Oh God" is the word that you have to bring a chance. <clears throat> he called upon God to save him. That's great. Any more answer? the astronomical amount of hardness in this question is helping me to increase my frustration wow eto shundor english likhechho eta to amio likhte parbo na eto shundor in this quarantine time more that's great congratulations khub shundor ekta sentence likhechho he called upon god to save him wrong again don't show uh, any other answer i want i expect more answers i mean what are you doing Sa safia so what about you why don't you write down the answer oh, oh you are really so uh all right don't show you your answer is absolutely right thank you congratulations so you see he called upon god and requested to save him and requested to save him he called upon god and requested to save him uh and you have just written down he called upon god to save him yeah you are right a bit but actually there is please 
So please, sir, can I request to talk to the work colleague to better hold on? Your answer is somehow right. I mean, Ms. Wright, you call upon God and request to save him. That's great. Congratulations. Your answer is correct. So the next, next, then the last one is here before you. So the last one is here before you. The teacher said to him, you have got GPO 5. Uh, this is the answer that you have to write down. Then put requested, right? Yeah, you, uh, requested would be the best answer. So you have to use it. After that, your answer is correct. Now you are trying uh, good on. So some of the students probably have left. <coughs> okay, so uh, you just please write down the answer and look at the sentence there. I'm just giving you some clues because the sentence, the statement is in the uh, affirmative but there is a question mark at the end of it so do you know any rule if there is any question mark after assertive sentence uh, what will be the chance the teacher asked him with surprise if he had got gp5 all right sir it's me or is this the grammar class of bcs students <laughs> Okay, uh, that is the thing that you need to know, of course. Currently, narration is a topic that you have to learn it uh, up to your BCS exam or after your last of your life. Okay, Friday test. There is an announcement like that. So, Friday Let's see, and your answer, Junshio, your answer is correct, absolutely. You are, you are right answer, uh, that's good. And your answer is here, being surprised. You have written down surprise, after that your answer is correct. Being surprised, the teacher asked him if he had got GPA 5. That means, I'm going to say this sentence, she should have a question mark. That means, she question mark, she should have a question mark. Being surprised, she should have a question mark. Being surprised, they cost a bubble for me to me. Uh, like a you are right. The teacher asked him with surprise. Like a it's a correct answer, so no problem. So, probably uh, there are five exceptional rules that you must. Uh, Amraji will go for three classes after going three classes. A thinta class, she's quarter for a kin to amada a problem school of Hagbana. So, the first one, Amra Shiklan, I'm going to school. Second would be going home. Excuse me, Thakle. Respectfully baked hoy. Aruthaja Andriel passed the clear no change of tense, who got the clear called upon hoy. Abang SIDVS is a question mark the clear. SIDVS is a question mark the clear to shake a trash being surprised hoy. Okay, let's see. Probably the examples were the hardest one, no doubt. But you have to know. If you just escape it, if you don't try to learn it, so there will be a great problem as this is the first class so i want to start the class from the very beginning uh, very beginning or the earlier one so you just look at this here you see the direct speech because we know narration and speech is divided into two ones uh, two parts one is uh, direct and the one is indirect so in indirect speech uh, there are some parts uh, that we have to uh, and we have to know what are the changes that we will bring to make it indirect space so you just go to the examples there he said to me i'm going to school now so this time this time can you please write down the answer this time can you please this is the easiest example probably in the world each and everyone has to write down the answer So 
sir, is it me or is this the grammar class of BCL students? Who is in this profile? James, Mr. James. This time you please write down the answer. He told me that he was going to school then. That's great, Hamim. So all model legal he told me that he was going to school then. Absolutely correct answer. Please carry on writing. Everyone, I, this time I want to see everyone writing the answer. Take a Naliko. Class the class class Safia told me that he was going to school then. That's wonderful. Kamrul Konik then Bananda Bhul Ligacho. T H A N Nababa. T H E N Nababa. And uh, of course, Shava Rutha right. Thank you. That's great. You were Kushito, James. Uh, he told me that he was going to school then. Just look at this sentence and here you see there are two parts. One is called this called reporting verb and this subject of reporting verb this is called object of reporting verb. And inverted common mode is report is speech. So how many parts are there? How many parts are there? He is called subject of reporting verb and say true is called reporting verb and then uh, me is called object and within the comma inverted comma jeta thakke sheta shanta amadeke bola hai report in speech and we report in speech sir abar tinta bhaab thakke but tinta angsho thakke yekhane person tense are others thakke okay person tense are others thakke and comma inverted comma is the only sign to uh, to know what type of speech it is whether it's direct or indirect a relief that's great thank you Achha. and whenever yeah, you uh, will change a direct speech into direct ones so then uh, you have to bring some changes so first thing uh, sometimes I compare this narration with uh, with uh, with a game একটা গেম এর সাথে তুলনা করে থাকি যে ভার্চুয়াল কোপ একটা গেম আছে বা যে এখন এখন লেটেস্ট পাবজি না পাবজি সো সেই গেমটা যেখানে শুট করতে হয় আর কি তো এই যে এই গেমসটা খেলতে হলে তোমার পাঁচটা ইউ হ্যাভ ফাইভ এনিমিস টু কিল তোমার পাঁচটা শত্রু থাকবে যাদেরকে হত্যা করতে হবে সো হোয়াট আর দোজ ফাইভ এনিমিস ইউ ক্যান ক্যান ইউ প্লিজ রাইট ডাউন देयर নেমস নেম অফ ইওর এনিমিস দ্যাট ইউ হ্যাভ টু কিল সো এনিওয়ান would you please write down any of your enemies that you have to kill and almost all of your answers are correct thank you congratulations that's great earlier right the first one is rv reporting verb and the second one you please keep on carry on writing uh, the writing your enemies that you have to kill changing of the tense that's great i mean reporting verb that's wonderful and the next one okay the first one we have got the reporting verb that is called rv or reporting verb okay uh, other four enemies other four enemies comma inverted comma that's good safia i'm going to comma inverted comma right person chains that's good comma inverted comma right person chains wow your answer is correct thank you person chains have a phone number of the tense and five number here and now words sometimes we call it others it is camera others pull it like by here and now here and now words you to on it do you think in this question I'm on the due to the issue for you to know yet the place are at the time okay that's why I'm gonna hear and now words will be changed into uh, remoteness remote words regular remote nest referring words okay now cut it i don't say uh, nikot bhorti are now that you then why get a goal i remote to world and here and hours that's good congratulations so all these are the five enemies about narration and uh, what is the biggest challenge of narration national shop to water challenge the key it helps you up to water challenge the only grammatical topic in mode to more actors on if you think about only allah can save us so we are writing none but unlike and save us just to make it negative 
but in narration that is not the thing you have all these rules together and uh, unfortunately if you miss uh, to or if you forget to change bring any change of the any any of the topic then you are total answer will be wrong that is the challenge the shop quarter rules to my can actually the cards for the put take the sentence and want the shop for the rules actually the cards for the data on no topic take a journal a topic the different the only topic the journal got in like it get the shop cool rules get my action they can implement what power so be careful about all of these things these five things that we have to bring a chance to make it in the space so next how will we bring the changes next the question so gradually we'll go one by one as we know uh mother j in narration it sentence on which i shop which body button tense on which i know a present is that long of a past tense that you don't have a shit on a tense to also for you what on how we can to sentence on which i shop rules could have got for the sentence quite broker i'm a jenny past broker acid even to get even better to objective exclamatory right so ej we have five types of sentences and all the rules will go surrounding uh, this rule, uh, this sentence. Each sentence is chapter by day good to talk about. And uh, first of all, you have to know how many types of sentences, what are their structures, how to make them, and how to mean them, how to write them, how to know the structures of them. So, a quarter look into Agatha Kijana factor. So, change of reporting verb, Ketamra Deki. Uh, you see there is a chart and this chart is uh, called sometimes a college software you have to be very careful or alert about all of this uh, chart uh, and uh, uh, the first one you see reporting verb said or said to take a certain way said on what told was the internet we asked to go inquired of was it are it imperative uh, imperative advised order requested for the two other told was it that man also the other issue for the show on the road mission johan i'm not going to boost the power one of the national told was over after the way we stood over play that exclaimed to the exclaimed to joy sorrow to a wonderful ticket set out of a surprise anger it on a shop with my progeny of the boss of the world that's good these are the rules probably you know i will ask you questions now economic to push to the shit out to the state of the bus state to take a सेड अथवा सेड टू उठेगी है। ऑप्टेटिव सेंटेंस है की बॉश है। हमें एक टू लिखे जाना होता है। आह बेक्ट पॉश जो द एक्सक्यूज़ शोमाश ले बेक बोल रहे हैं। ऑप्टेटिव ये सेड अथवा सेड टू उठेगी है की बॉश है। प्लीज़ राइट डाउन योर आंसर सेड अथवा सेड टू उठेगी वेस्ट बॉश है। ऑप्टिटिव है आर किस बात से ना बेक टीम पर डिवेल एक्सेप्शन दैट्स गुड अच्छा प्लेट बॉस है राइट हाँ मैम थैंक यू शो शुद्ध एक जो नहीं आते हैं आर क्यों नहीं एक है ना वेस्ट और प्लेट दैट्स गुड वेस्ट और तो बात प्लेट बॉस है अच्छा एक नाम के बोलो जो इम्पार्टिव सेंटेंस है कौन लेट बॉस है no no sorry uh, wrong question so i'm going to imperative sentence a common bad boss yeah it's all the the other to double the team that's wonderful thank you uh wish to almighty for someone okay uh late tackle right that boss लेट था क्ले दैट बोशे दैस गुड अच्छा तार पर हम क्या बोलो इंटरेक्टिव सेंटेंस से जो द डब्ल्यूएस था के तालो कॉमा इन्वर्ट कॉम उठेगी एक ही है इंटरेक्टिव सेंटेंस से डब्ल्यूएस था क्ले कॉमा इन्वर्ट कॉम उठेगी एक ही है डब्ल्यूएस वाई राइट दैस गुड ना कॉमा इन्वर्ट कॉम उठी ये अपूर्व अपूरुपा अच्छा आई एम सॉरी तो मैं आक्स तो लिखा चुका आक्स तो बहुत सी सेड होता है बस सेड टू उठी ये डब्ल्यूएस आई मैं बोला थी इंटरेक्टिव सेंटेंस से कॉमा इन्वर्ट कॉम आज जो डब्ल्यूएस था के कॉमा इन्वर्ट कॉम उठी ये क्यों है डब्ल्यूएस ही बोल गया 
if whatever weather will do. If whatever weather will do. Perhaps uh, you know the rules very well. And this is the thing that you have to keep it in your memory. Like that, tomake bola shikta hobe je sail of the say two thingy assertive sail of the word told. Integrative if whatever W is poshe. Sorry. Integrative asked poshe. That for objective wish to the word prayed. Imperative advised order requested for with proposed to the word told. Are exclamatory to exclaim to joy or out of a wonder. Our second topic is our common work from out of a high. Common work from out of a high. I'm ready to give you a word. If you have a weather banana to blue low W E W H E T H E R. It's a hobby now over. Don't show it a hobby now. That's it. So you see comma in work comma and comma in work from out of a high. That was it. That for integrative if or the W is possible, imperative to or the that question are objective that one exclamatory with that. So I'm right to take about the assertive, objective, exclamatory, thin jaga on the that question. I want to be imperative right on shape that question. I will show you another integrative term on a rack, integrative if or the W is possible are two question. So this is so easy, perhaps to add a monarch. So it is the monarch the part of the only on it of a yellow that for another J. नाउन प्रोनाउन का विषय टाइप आया था, जैसे जब प्रोनाउन का तीन का फॉर्म था, एक ता सब्जेक्ट और ऑब्जेक्ट के वर्ड पॉसिबल, दिस वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट, बिकॉज़ इफ यू डोंट नो देम, यू कैन नॉट गो फॉर द चेंज ऑफ़ द चेंज ऑफ़ द प्रोनाउन्स, राइट? एंड इफ यू मेक मिस्टेक देयर, ऑफ़ कोर्स � therefore he him is among you your and then and the what are the person change first person uh, change of according to subject of reporting verb that means first place I mean you double see that for second person also the second place did also object of reporting verb and third person no chance that person no chance that's how the teacher on issue is for them yeah it the first person first place second person second place third person बोले थे मैं जेतू तो खाना हमारा बोलता हूँ थर्ड प्लेस जब बोलते हैं नो 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 थर्ड प्लेस ना देर इस नो थर्ड प्लेस नो चेंज इट विल बी नो चेंज थैंक यू आह ओके वी आर गोइंग नेस्ट फॉर द चेंज ऑफ द टेंसेस जब देर यू सी डायरेक्ट है कि इंडिकेट जेतू होले ऑल प्रेजेंट विल टर्न इनटू पास पास्ट हुए जावे तो प्रेजेंट इंडिकेटिंग था वो क्या होगा पास्ट इंडिकेटिंग प्रेजेंट कंटिन्यूअस क्या होगा पास्ट कंटिन्यूअस प्रेजेंट परफेक्ट क्या होगा पास्ट परफेक्ट प्रेजेंट परफेक्ट कंटिन्यूअस पास्ट परफेक्ट कंटिन्यूअस एंड ऑल पास्ट टेंस से हम लोग जाने आवाज़ चार्टा भाग दो थे पास्ट टेंस से चार्टा भागे मतलब दो टा भागे पूरी होते हैं भागे एक तो उसे पास्ट इंडिफिनेट एक तो पास्ट कंटिन्यूस सो पास्ट इंडिफिनेट होले पास्ट परफेक्ट होगा पास्ट कंटिन्यूस थे तो पास्ट परफेक्ट डिडी मैंने अमीज़ अर्थ थकले वाज़ वर्ड हो गए वाज़ वर्ड थकले हैड बीन हो गए हैवेस थकले हैड हो गए सो ये भागे इन दिस वे यू कैन जस्ट आई कैन टीच यू विदाउट नोइंग द टेंस बट इट्टा कोई एम्बिगुअस एक्ट हो गया पर तो कोई एब्सर्ड एक्ट हो गया पर ये भाव अनेक टीचर के अमीज़ शिखाते देखे बस तुम्हें वाणी बड़ी उसी का प्रेजेंट इंडिफिनेट पास्ट इंडिफिनेट एक बार पास्ट इंडिफिनेट है जो कहना हमें आई डिड नॉट गो टू स्कूल तब ले आई डिड नॉट गो था क्लिक किया हुआ है तुम्हें पास्ट परफेक्ट है हैड नॉट गोन हो गए सो सिंपल इफ यू नो अबाउट द टेंस एंड देन शेल विल था क्लिक शुड so it should be had seen. Uh, probably you can understand all of these things. And then some here and now and there words this tackle that over this tackle goes now tackle then to the tackle that day tomorrow tackle the next day yesterday tackle the previous account tackle go over but tackle express this satisfaction I take to calculate 
express dissatisfaction kintu sob shomoy hoy na dhore nao je you are not starting properly so your mother said but yeah tumi to mark one chao baje korcho je ma jano e porikha to ami gpa 5 pao inshallah ham ta english e rese sob class korechi so i must get the 99% marks in english ha so ma bolte chhe ar chao baje korash na but i am really dissatisfied about your reason তাহলে মা যখন এই বাট কথাটা ব্যবহার করছে তার মানে মায়ের মধ্যে এক ধরনের ডিসস্যাটিসফ্যাকশন প্রকাশ ছিল এই বি কেয়ারফুল অ্যাবাউট দ্য মিনিং অফ দিস সেন্টেন্সেস যে এক্সপ্রেস ডিসস্যাটিসফ্যাকশন তখন কিন্তু ব্যবহার করতে হবে বাট এই বাট কিন্তু কনজাংশন হিসেবে একটা কোঅর্ডিনেটিং কনজাংশন হিসেবে এটা আগের সেন্টেন্সের সাথে অ্যাড হয়ে যেতে পারে আই উইল গিভ মোর एग्जांपल्स লাইক দ্যাট ওয়াই ওয়াই ইজ ইট কলড হিয়ার এন্ড নাও ওয়ার্ডস দ্যাটস গুড জুনশি গুড কোশ্চেন चेन्ज हो जाए फलोईंग understand it so what are the five changes in the direct speech remember the past je jinish e poriborton korte hobe she past ta jinish ki ki ashole acha past ta jinish e poriborton ki ki first one is reporting verb second one is comma inverted comma third one is person fourth one is tense and the fifth one is others okay uh, and you know so i will give you one sentence there so you will have to write it down you will have to write it down yes so please write down now uh, write down make it in the indirect speech it can indirect speech change karo so reader say to me i am watching my favorite program now so write down the answer Uh, this time so easy example right reza told me that uh, he is watching his favorite program then is watching can on the it is can hobe right i mean your answer is correct thank you congratulations he was watching his favorite program then that's the right answer thank you thank you is the right answer so this time i will just give some more examples and exercises as well so that for, yeah, we will have to write down these answers so easy i think you must uh, write it down everyone you will write it down and of course you will be able to write down the answer right reza told me that he is cano he is cano licho why aren't you using the uh, bringing the change of tense tense er keno poriborton korcho na tense er poriborton keno hocche na keno korcho na So you please uh, write down the answer. There you see the teacher said to him, "You have obtained GPA five. You have obtained GPA five." Uh, you please write down the answer. The teacher told him that he had obtained GPA five. That's good. एवरीवन प्लीज राइट ऑन द आंसर সবাই মিলে উত্তর লিখো আমি কিন্তু সহজ একটা উত্তর হিয়ার অবটেন জিপিএ 
Here, obtain GP5. That's good. And, and the next, next, yes, your answer is correct. So this time you just just write down answer two. Do you know what to leave? আমি শুধু চার পাঁচ জনকে দেখছি যে মানে হামিম সাফিয়া জুনসিও জামান এবার কোন ঝামেলা নেই কোন ইউ ডোন্ট হ্যাভ এনি কাইন্ড অফ সিকিউরিটি according to you go according to the rules so one thing that you have to be very careful about the rules. that means you are changing uh, are you changing all these five topics or not pasta je jinisha poriborton korte hocche seta tumi poriborton korcho kina just be careful about that etai ar kichu ar onno kichu nei yes your answer is correct thank you so kids say that a thing of beauty is joy forever that's the right answer thank you congratulations uh, james congratulations and rokun jaman so that's next question for you is here the teacher say to him you have done this work yourself you have done this work yourself the teacher say to him you have done this work yourself uh, right konik your answer is great thank you congratulations because this is a universal truth or saying যখন হবে হ্যাবিচুয়াল ফ্যাক্ট যখন হবে তখন আসলে আমাদের টেন্সে কোনো পরিবর্তন হবে না দেয়ার উইল বি নো চেঞ্জ ইন দ্য টেন্স ইফ ইউর স্টেটমেন্ট ইজ হ্যাবিচুয়াল ফ্যাক্ট ইউনিভার্সাল ট্রুথ অর আ সেইং রাইট দ্যাস গুড ওকে গো অন ফর দ্য নেক্সট আনসার দিস টাইম ওয়ান থিং সো ইজি সো ইজি ফার্স্ট ইউ জাস্ট ফাইন্ড আউট হোয়াট টাইপ অফ সেন্টেন্স ইজ এটা আসলে কোন ধরনের সেন্টেন্স সেই সেন্টেন্সটা তুমি আগে আইডেন্টিফাই করো ইন দ্য রিপোর্টেড স্পিচ এম স্পিচ দা হোয়াট টাইপ অফ সেন্টেন্স এন্ড ইউ জাস্ট ফাইন্ড দ্যাম আউট এন্ড দেন ইউ গো ফর দ্য চেঞ্জ রেকর্ড রাফিদ আই ওয়ান্ট টু সি ইউ আর রাইটিং দ্য আনসার দ্য টিচার টোল্ড হিম দ্যাট হি হ্যাড ডান দ্য ওয়ার্ক হিমসেল সো ইজি শোর না থ্যাংক ইউ মা এটা খুব চমৎকার হয়েছে সবাই শুধু রাইট আনসার হয়েছে this type of answers i want to see everyone writing the answer shobai uttor likho eta dekhte chai as i hear done his work and this work himself that's great yes your yeah, congratulations your answer is correct the teacher told him that he had done the work himself and then the next one is before you the man said you are reading this book at this moment
So I want to see you writing this answer. The man said you are reading this book at this moment. So simple. You just go for the statement. What type of statement it is? It has to be a statement. It also is like a uh, assertive, right? It also is a assertive statement. So assertive is what we say. Say that say to take it. Why? Say that like say that say to take like told. Okay. So we have the say to write. So we have the say to write. The man said that for like that to write. ये बार देखो जो you wrote you वो से एक second person ये second person होले हमारे second place को object में जो परिवर्तन हो रखा था but एक है ना object का नहीं ये there is no object तो खंड तो अगर ना first person आते हैं तो धोर नहीं है तार मैंने दा boy said to me दा boy said to me एक बात है धोर नहीं है ताला दा boy said to me ना that और तब दा boy told me that said के पहले said to के पहले object बस ना तो को absurd एक तो बिश ये जो नाम ला सेट ट्यूर बोलते हैं टोल बॉस है वो सेट ट्यूर राग बो ना सेट ट्यूर बोलते हैं सोचना है कि वो शेड ही वो टोल बो शेड ही वो तब मैं दाम मैंने टोल मी दैट तब मैंने आई वाज रीडिंग दिस टक की हो जावे दिस टक अश्ले दा होवे ये बोलता शवाई कोड़ चुको ना है ये बोलता कि शवाई कोड़ च ए दिस टा जो भी दाना कोड़ दा होले सेंडेस टा भूल हो। वन थिंग यू हैव टू बी वेरी केयरफुल। देर आर टू दिस, दिस बुक एंड दिस मोमेंट। सो ए आज के ए रूस तो आवश्य शिखनी भी है। दिस वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट रूस। ऐसा तो दिस से पढ़े जो खान नाउन थक बे तो खान दिस टा आश्ले दा होए जावे। बट दिस this moment, this evening, this morning, this year, that regular time. If you have time, then you can do this. If you have time, then you can do this. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? This is the book and this moment is the moment. Probably you have got the answer. This answer is correct. And almost all of you have written the wrong answer. So you see the man said that this is the book and this moment is the moment. And almost all of you have written the wrong answer. I was reading the book at that moment. So this was an exceptional rules. You keep it in your mind. It's a moment. Individually, act a sentence moment. What did I say? This, that, those. If you have a noun, it will be a noun. If you have a noun, it will be a noun. It will be a noun. So simple thing. And the next answer, next question, and the last, last, probably the last sentence is here. The man said, I work for an hour. I work for an hour every morning. Okay, and please write down the answer. The book at the moments. Na June show. You me at the tick koro. At the at the moment. Na me to agi utho tick koro diye chhe. So the man said that I was reading the book at that moment because moment is a time mentioning word. Okay, you please write down. Please write on uh, the next answer. I work uh, here. You see, mm. so you look at this sentence here. You see, each sentence today a habitual fact. Prokash Pati, what's a habitual fact? I work for an hour every morning. I'm putting in chocolate egg on the hat. That means it's a habitual fact. जो भी हैबिचुअल फैक्ट यूनिवर्सल ट्रूथ है, ताहले शेखते आश्चर्य टेंस से कोनो परिवर्तन हो बेना। हम इम्प्लीड किस वो ग्रेट कांग्रेसलेशन, द मैन सेड दैट ही वर्क्स फॉर एन आवर एवरी मॉर्निंग। दैट्स गुड। ताहले एक है ना देर विल बी नो चेंज ऑफ़ द टेंस। टेंस से कोनो परिवर्तन इजे पास्टर रू पास्टर सेंटेंस एक तो जस्ट हमरा एक तो गोस्ट्रो कोडी अब हम बहुत हर चेस्टर कोडी जा शुरू की की कोल ना इतने क्या अनेक कोठीन की चीज़ चिलो कोठीन की चीज़ कोन चिलो ना फर्स्ट सेंटेंस एक लॉकअप कोडे एक एसेटिव सेंटेंस एसेटिव सेंटेंस वाला सही टू ठीक है हमारे टूल बोल बे ऑब्जेक्ट तार पर एक तो यूनिवर्सल ट्रूथ जो ही था कि कारों सेम है हैबिचुअल फैक्ट है तो वहाँ टेंस से पूरी वर्तन है ना एक टाइप था एवं एक टाइप था दूसरा चल गया लो अब एक अंतर है थर्ड नंबर हम लोग की पेज़ है यू हैव डैम दिस वर्क 
yourself. So, say to your brother, don't push it, take an asserting statement, chilo, that for a common word, come out at that person, put it on for a test, put it on words. That like a jammy, almost taken our chat to put it on words. A reporting word words, a common word, come out, a person, which a test words, right? A woman with a character person. That will let to me, you will always count. How many how many changes have you brought? To mark the past a visual polyvorton court of hoche, she passed a visual polyvorton hoche. Just look at your counting every time. Because to me, you can show off tick corrasle, I can have it for himself to change colon, yourself with a kitten. Tawali keep put a put out to the Buddha. The echo person could take the change corrosion. Talma to me, the echo reporting bar change corrosion, common word, comma person, change shop polyvorton corrosion in the echo narrator person, a jet to polyvorton go to Buddha. That means your answer is wrong. This is narration. That's why you have to be so alert and careful. You have to open your eyes uh, bigger so that you can see all the words together. Okay. So you can see all the words In this way, you can uh, just practice it at home uh, and you will be able to learn it properly. So, okay. And then your homework is here. Uh, you see, you will go for your homework and exercise book and there you will solve uh, some five exercises, uh, one, two, three, four, five, from your homework and exercise book. And paragraph D and D you will write, learn and write in your copy and they will, you must send them in my messenger, okay, in my messenger, of course. And uh, I think uh, you will all, in the, in the next two classes are really very important because in these two, two classes, next two classes I will go for all the exception rules. I'm going to pour it with a class say I'm sure of Joto exception rules as a single of for our so I think you will be very uh, careful about that and you must have in the classes okay uh, next two classes and then uh, the next Friday you will have a test on this uh, narration among narration report should the sentence for your turn as well I feel in the blanks as will be MCQ question as well and take a say among different types of question that way that you go to me if you don't have any clear conception about each and uh, every specific uh, idea uh, rule to my the jana not like the relation post number root to the department because I think uh, you will go through this class again and you will give at least a like to my uh, classes to my videos I'm mean, like uh, my compile so they can actually uh, perhaps you don't like my classes that's why I'm really sorry if uh, my class is not up to that mark uh, and uh, if you have any kind of suggestion or advice you can just uh, write to me so that I can improve it inshallah so let's go uh, to the end of the class here so thank you very much and especially thanks for your attention and for your cooperation and for your participation in this class uh, I hope you all will attend in the next class also so uh, see you one Tuesday until then uh, I am uh, until then by Allah person thank you bye bye